All right. Kiyun. G'day, mate. G'day, Walter. How are you? It's been a while since we've actually done this, yes. right? Yeah. I what mean, happened? <laughs> we had scheduling conflicts mm. a lot before we... Mm -hmm. um, for, for the past, I think it was like three weeks, we, yeah. you and I have not been able to shoot anything because I've been too busy or you've been too busy or something's happened or mainly, uh, I think it's my daughter that's been sick, but... Yeah, I heard like a lot of um, kids mm. are getting sick these days, even mm. more like when they go to Odinichi, like yeah. it's like an inf <laughs> I shouldn't say this, but it's like an infected area. It is. It and is. like they get better, they go back to Odinichi and then they get sick again. Yeah. And the cycle just happens and the parents end up getting sick as well. Yeah. Including yourself. So I have gotten sick a few times of, uh, you got sick as yeah. well, right? I think Corona. <laughs> really? Because <laughs> that's going around again. Yes. Yeah, it's, there's another huge spike of corona happening. Um, I think I did get corona. I didn't get tested because oh, okay. nowadays I think most people, hey, don't do that. <laughs> I mean, we don't have to quarantine anymore, do that's we? True. Yeah, so yeah. I take it as like a flu now. Okay. Like a, it is new, a flu. new type yeah. of flu. Yeah. A new type of flu. And I know I should be, no, I was wearing a mask. Mm. And then it was, the funny thing is when you wear a mask, people mm. are like, you have corona? No, oh, yeah. It's yeah. very different to like two, three years ago. Where yeah, yeah, yeah. You had to be wearing a mask. Right. If you were the one who wasn't wearing one, they would be like, oh, what the hell's wrong with him? Yeah, yeah. But yeah. now it's the other way around. <laughs> I, so remember those days where like you had to wear masks? That was horrible. And it didn't pair well with the summer heat that we're having at the moment. Oh, let's not talk about the heat. Like, it's really hot here in this area. It's actually really hot. I'm sweating in the this. They um, yeah. in this, uh, just in this studio here, but... What's yeah. been happening? What's been happening with this heat, especially, like, <laughs> as most people would know, we're going through, like, the rainy season. We, we, we went through the rainy season, we did. right? And now it's just pure humidity. I actually miss the rain. Yeah, I miss the rain as well. <laughs> I want the rain to come back. It's just been so, so hot here in Korea. Like, um, supposedly this year is the hottest year on record. Yeah, for like, it's been first time in like 100 what years. It's yeah. Been like, yeah. like the heat wave has yeah. been like the longest. Yeah. In 100 odd years. And I'm like, yeah, I can feel that. I, <laughs> I haven't lived for 100 years, that. but it seems like, to, yeah, but it seems crazy. like every year is like the hottest year on season. Like, it just doesn't seem to be going down. It so, seems... like, some, um, like, scientists were saying, this will be the coolest summer ever. Oh, really? Well, this year will be the coolest summer because next year it's going to get hotter. Yeah. And the year after it's going to get hotter and hotter it, and hotter. Oh, jeez. If this is the coolest summer ever, I don't want to know what next year is going to be like. I mean, I can't even go outside now without, like, sweating like that. Because like... the difference between summer in uh, Korea and Australia is, Australia is not that humid. Yeah, it's, it's quite only, dry, isn't it? It's, um, it? Like in the northern areas, like mm. in northern Queensland, it's quite humid. But if you oh, go yeah. down from there, like Brisbane and Gold Coast, there's humidity, but it's not like, like I think Korea's t turned into like Southeast Asia, basically. Definitely like a tropical. Yeah, tropical. Area. Yeah, humid. the weather as well. And like even the rain. Yeah. It's just like boom, 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 just boom, like boom. Back cats and, and dogs yeah. just absolutely pouring down pissing down rain and next minute it's like sunny outside sunny <laughs> like, then like, so like what happened you know Nothing just happened. humid i don't even know how to do like we're supposed to be cooling down at the moment like it's supposed to be technically yeah like, looking at the past it should be much cooler now but it's still like around 30 degrees now that's it's well i think it's like even more at the moment it's like it? 34 <sighs> or something like that so that's why you, you could probably see <laughs> We're short shorts, shorts, wearing short shorts. Short shorts are very like Australian Aussie lads. Thing. Yes. And the thing is, like, I mean, Korea has great air conditioning system. You have AC like yeah. everywhere you go, any building you go into, which is a great advantage for us. But at the same time, the reason I got sick, like <laughs> after I got COVID, I got the Nengbang Pyong. I don't yeah, know yeah, what yeah. they call it in English. I've never had that until I came to Korea. So it's like air conditioned flu. <laughs> You get flu from like air conditioning yeah, or something there's like, like that. There's a big difference between the weather outside yeah, and the yeah. inside. And like if you're going back and forth, your body can't really adapt to the changes and eventually you get sick. And yeah. of course, like when you're inside and there are a lot of people, obviously like the virus will go around because it's less ventilation as mm -hmm. well. So I got sick for like a month or so and oh, I'm yeah. like, oh, I'm hating this. That's why we couldn't film as well. Like That as well. Yeah, yeah that was one. Oh, I just, I caught it. 
not too long ago as well. In COVID? No, uh, <laughs> Neng Man Pyong. Like, oh, Neng Man Pyong. Yeah, it was, <sighs> it's, it's worse than a cold, to be honest with you. It just, it, it plays with your whole entire body. It's, it's oh, terrible to have. So it, there's no escape, like summer, there's no escaping any sickness. It's either the flu's getting around, COVID is now getting around. Um, with children, like hand, foot, mouth disease yeah. are getting around. So yeah. Yeah, yeah, which is something my daughter caught. And mm. uh, luckily I didn't catch because supposedly it is really popular. Uh, well, it's very, it can be spread amongst adults as well, but I didn't get it. And I heard it was like really painful. Yeah, I heard it's really painful. And from what I saw with my daughter, it was quite painful, I think. But... Yeah, it's just, this is why I hate Korean summers. <laughs> this is why I hate Korean summers. There's nothing good about it. There's, it's all terrible. Like, I, I would, if I had enough money, what I'd do is like, whenever Korean summer comes along, I'd just live in another country. That's what I was just going <laughs> to say. Like, if I had enough money, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. one of my dreams is to live somewhere where it's like the weather is perfect and yeah. then just come back to my hometown when the weather's perfect here. So yeah. like just travel around like during the best times of the year, but yeah. there's nothing you can do. We're kind of stuck here. Are you, do you sweat easy? <laughs> I don't actually. Oh, I do. Oh, I'm sweating, I can I'm sweating tell. <laughs> I'm sweating now. I'm embarrassed to be on camera. I'm just swimming right now. Yeah. I don't sweat that easily, but obviously I don't like the heat. Yeah. yeah. What would you prefer? Would you prefer the, the, the freezing, uh, Seoul winter or the, the scorching, humid, hot summer of Seoul? You know, I used to prefer summer yeah. over winter by far, but yeah. now <laughs> things have the changed. Way. Yeah. I actually miss winter right now. Oh, I can't wait for this winter. Yeah. I really I'd can't rather wait. be in a really, really cold place than like just here right now. It's, you know how like Koreans used to say, or they still say like Korea has four seasons. It doesn't feel like that anymore. Now it's two. Now it's just two. It's either hot or cold. It's either like ridiculously hot <laughs> or freezing. So I feel like people out there who are like denying mm. climate change, I don't know how you can when you have the f most, co like we have had like one of the coldest winters that just passed. We did. Yeah. And now this is like one of the hottest summers and who knows what's happening this winter. But oh, I just, I'm so sick of this weather. I'm so sick of sweating. Like, uh, I can't even go outside to for a second without like just dripping sweat. Yeah, it's a sad thing. Like, I mean, we only have ourselves to blame <laughs> for this yeah, uh, global true. warming. Like, I'm not helping in yeah, any way. Yeah, exactly. Like, <laughs> we're frustrated. We're saying so much bad things about the weather, but we are the ones who actually create this whole, you know, phenomenon. And yeah. like, I mean, Earth didn't do anything bad to us. I know. We <laughs> we're just living here. We're just shitting everywhere. Exactly. <laughs> um, making it hotter and hotter every year. And I think it's a collective action that we all need to take, but we just really don't because mm. I don't know why. Like, people are like, it's getting so hot. It's getting so cold. Mm. But we can do something about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, we shouldn't be really using plastic. But <laughs> yes, I just cancel. Or just you said. know, <laughs> we shouldn't be really using what are they called? The cup holders for cold drinks. Exactly. <laughs> and like, whatever happened to those like paper straws? Yeah, I there guess was, there was a lot of controversy as well. Like mm. paper, like what they use to stick the paper together. I mean, yeah, I know, like. But there are things we can do. Um, but the thing is, like, if you're, if it's like 30 watt degrees outside, super humid, you need the AC. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> we need electricity. Like, like we well, do need energy, but... It's a first world <sighs> problem, like, having, like, no, uh, like, like um, <laughs> AC. Because, you know, back in the day, we didn't have, like, a long time ago. Even, I think, when we were, like, kids, AC were, wasn't really a thing, right? It was exactly. just fans. So we're very lucky to have AC, but yeah, it's just blasted on all day at my house. I don't know what it's like at your house, but it's just all day, all night. Me too. Yeah. They can't even open the window because it's just, even at night, it's so humid. So oh, anyway, <laughs> I miss Australian heat because it is dry and I can do dry. I can, I can deal with the... Like it's it's it's, it's almost painful the Australian um, sun because you do like get a sun burn, burn. Yeah, yeah. burn right, but the humidity if depending on where you live mm. is is tolerable. It's just and also like yeah. you're only like a one hour drive from a beach. Like oh yeah, the closest beach would be like what 30, 40, or like one or two hours. But 
in Korea, if you do want to go to like a proper kind of like the ocean or the sea mm. to go for a swim in the beach, you would have to go basically to the e c which is like <laughs> takes you like minimum three four hours there's nothing in Incheon there's exactly like, Inchon, like, Inchon is just the flat west water. area is like I wouldn't really call it a beach it's just would, like it's just rocks and water <laughs> just sea water just like flo- yeah you rocks floating you can't go swimming in there yeah Kawan, like the Kondo area that that west side is where you want to be going but it's so far from uh, Seoul if you live in Seoul but and it's super crowded as well like I mean there are water parks, I know. Mm. I actually drove past a water park and it was so hot outside. I was yeah. thinking, hey, how are you going to enjoy like, like the water activities when it's super hot outside? Mm. Even if you go in the water, I mean, the water will feel really warm, mm. <laughs> even if it's cool. So I'm thinking, hey, this is not the best place to live in. No, I'm not, I'm just talk, I'm not talking about just Seoul. Like, yeah. All across the world, like even yeah. in America, they're going through heat waves. Even in Iran as well, yeah, they reached yeah. like 40 something degrees. That's ridiculous. And a lot of building, like government buildings were shut down mm. for a few days as well. And I think we should have that as well. I think we should <laughs> like, as well. Stay home, everyone. <laughs> I feel like, You're going to burn to death. Um, oh, it's, it's so ridiculous. Look, I'm these sweating days. right now. I'm, <laughs> it is hot. So I think that's where we should wrap it up because we need to go and find somewhere cool. Before I we think. sweat more. Before, like this is embarrassing for me <laughs> on being on camera. So can you see the sweat? Patch? Yeah, oh, you, that's why I'm not. My arm. That's why you were doing this I'm the whole time. I'm this. Your patch. Yeah, I know. I've got. I want to oh. swim in that patch. Yeah, exactly. Enough. And these pants. Oh, if I get up, they'll probably have sweat marks on the butt. But anyway, hopefully we've the, we've pulled some. English phrases out there for did you. Did we? I, I think we did. I hope we did. Actually. I'll figure it out anyway in, in the editing. But <laughs> you guys seem to enjoy that sort of content. So mm. we're going to continue doing it. Yeah. And uh, we'll see you hopefully next week because we will hopefully not have any more delays on yeah. these videos. We'll make this like a weekly thing. And um, if you like those expressions, we'll keep making them. So guys, you know mm. what that means, right? Right. <laughs> like, subscribe and use the bell and... Stay cool, guys. Yeah, please stay cool. And be careful of Nengbang Pyong and, of course, Corona as well, guys. Yes, as well as head and foot and mouth disease, as well as the flu, as well as everything, everything else. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.